I am very glad that I am releasing this video, because it should have been published for a long time, but I wanted to do it in December, so that at the end of the year I could please with great content. I'll tell you right away that there will be a lot of vetoes under the Roman cast, it may be 10 or 10 pieces. I don't know for sure myself yet, and I bought the video, it's purely in my first feelings. And then you will learn by attacking everything cool, as it seems at first glance. If I wanted to buy a Dreamcast for a very long time, but it so happened that any offer that slipped through, it was, to put it mildly, inadequate. And the cost for a dream in 10,000, 15,000 rubles was considered the norm. And what 15,000 for even an incomplete gaming system? This, as for me, is nonsense, so the search dragged on right to the horror. And it seems that there are proposals, they really exist, although there are few of them, but the price tag is too big. I just left it to better times and hop, 5,000 rubles, a nap with a box, everything is in perfect condition. How could you pass by such a gift? Of course, a couple of messages and already drinker is coming to me by mail. The video has been sent and in short, no problems for you. I didn't look at the pictures of the box at all and didn't see any catch. But when Dreamcast came to me, I realized that it was some kind of Lego. Look, I have no questions about the offer itself. The box is whole inside, there is even waste paper, but that's the joke. Maybe I don't know much about Dreamcasts, but even I understand that not everything is as rosy as it may seem. The box of the region has fallen, even this very instruction is full Russian. But the console is Japanese at the same time. At first I thought that the person bought a separate box and how would any questions? I myself wanted to do one with my PlayStation, but here's the joke in another. The Pavlovsky gamepad is the same. It turns out that the last console has known a different world and the person just bought another system. But it doesn't bother me and now I'll explain why. Really perfect condition. I was very surprised when she came to me, because it's like she's new. I probably don't have a single such game system so that it is in the most perfect condition. Not one. This is a straight emerald, very pleased with the condition. And what I want to say about the design of Sega Dreamcast. He's good, attractive even today. Four ports for controllers. And why is it always like this? Why, when you watch a video on YouTube, and then you buy some console yourself, you are always surprised by its dimensions. This is the smallest fat game system that has been released in the course, although it depends on how you look at it. But the Dreamcast is really small, he's such a kid, he came to me to get acquainted with other Sega systems. And now is it possible to buy the very first master player to collect a whole collection of Sega home gaming systems? If you watch about the master, then I will buy it, it's not difficult for me. And look at the comparison of Saturn, it's straight mega huge in comparison with Tvika and as if Sega released a version of the previous game system with it, but at the same time made it more powerful. Yes, so much so that in some parameters Dreamcast surpasses PlayStation 2. And Dreamcast came out in the 98th year, and the Jews in the 2000th. This is surprising. And you know, when you touch Sega systems, when you play on them, then, despite the company's failures to break everyone in this generation and the past, do you feel the quality? It's very pleasant for me to play on any seeker and it seems to be more soulful, you know. But these feelings are not enough to become the best not only in the generation, but in general. And despite the fact that Dreamcast is good, it is qualitatively assembled, this is not a conclusion, unfortunately, it was, and the company completely went to the bottom. I am too sorry for what happened, and there will be no more gaming system cut off, because they managed only once in the entire history of the company to do something truly fit and competitive. This is a mega drive or genesis for America. Everything else is a complete crack, even the giveaways are also a complete failure. So Sega will definitely not return to this information weaving market. And Dreamcast, as it was the last failed console, remained so. And what do we have on the gamepad? In fact, a very interesting controller came out, uncomfortable to the point of horror. After Regina's Xbox, I also didn't have any comfort when I was hacking into this whole thing. That is, you will have to get used to it again, it is inconvenient again, that there are too many buttons on Saturn, which is here. To reach the rear shifters, you need to hold this gamepad in a special way and honestly, not very much. But that's because my gaming journey wasn't started with this console. I actually met Dreamcast very recently. And, of course, I'm not used to this controller, 100% in the future it will get better. I understand that, but the first feelings are exactly like that. It's completely inconvenient. I did not have a view in the kit, this is a big problem for me personally, because in this case it is not possible to fully enjoy this system. The main feature, as I believe, is that the Dreamcast is locked in the view. This is the screen on the gamepad, have you seen this before? It turns out that Sega came up with Nintendo DI with two screens and just the second one serves either for the map, where your character's health is displayed there. But, again, I don't have one. I found it for 2000 rubles and now I'm thinking, to take it, not to take it, so I haven't decided. But most likely I will take it, because I want the maximum. I want to get everything from Dreamcastvo for which it was bought and all the chips should be involved. So I'll try to get the next vetoes, and so there's usually a map and that's it, it won't do, and the departure is like a crooked stump. Maybe I'll also buy a ramble pack. But this is generally a crunch, to sell vibration separately, I think it's just some kind of horror. 
learn the Apple, I also advise you to separately sell a Vibro pack and a sound pack, a touch pack, and generally just release a display without a gut and people will assemble iPhones for themselves, but this is a lyric, it's absolutely not close to me to pay for you to have a vibration. This is surprising, but Whitefish is not the first to do this from the fifth generation. This is, of course, the most beloved Nintendo with the H64 console. How it was possible to think of this, it strikes me simply. Imagine selling vibrations separately, yes it sounds so funny and it's a pity that I have no excuses for this action. Selling vibration, I will not be able to sleep peacefully for a long time after fully understanding what really happened in the 90s. Vibration, and what was it done for? Why not put a vibro pack in the gamepad itself, supposedly it fails faster? Yes, to put these vibro magic things in the kit, but no. So the situation is complete sir. I didn't think that this moment would surprise me so much, because I knew that this used to happen, and I was kind of calmer about it, but when you realize that now, after almost 25 years, you need to look for a ramp pack for a gamepad, because it wasn't included, it's far from the best idea and generally a way of entertainment. So these are the retro gaming systems. You should not take them if you are not ready to spend money on vibration conditionally, because these small elements are really important in order to get maximum comfort. I'm not talking about accessories, fishing rods, handlebars, I don't know what else was there, maybe some drums, but about important elements, vibration and view. It has to be, otherwise it's not the same. And in general, how to understand that the purchase was not made in vain? If you like anything at all, it doesn't matter, it's games, the pleasure of the console itself, the thrill of unpacking and so on, it's not for nothing. I had moments when I didn't even enjoy unpacking, but here, fortunately, there was no such thing, maybe the box was sealed, I don't know. But I like the console, if anything, and the emotions are positive. I haven't played it yet, I'm speaking exclusively as is. Vito's week with Dreamcast will be and for now I'm waiting for the game. I ordered a normal amount of them, when it comes, then I will take off a week. If anything, I had only one game in the kit, which is a full bottom. This is a resident, I don't even know which one, where you just had to shoot. Such games on the Dreamcast don't interest me at all, that is, you don't go. I tried it once, in principle, I appreciated the gamepad and that's it but I will make a full opinion a little later, and we will understand all this together with you. There will also be several comparison videos where the information will be very useful. It seems like what I want to compare, no one has done it. So the video will be exclusive and very cool. I'm buying it right now, the information is extremely useful. The kit also included an AV cable, on a non-modern TV, which only shows 10, 80, normally. The picture is better than on PS1 when connecting square at least, my PS1 shows a good result if you play on AV and you need a SCART. I will do this, though not understanding what is happening with Ali, I could not order anything when it was a Black Friday of the 22nd year. He writes that we do not send it to you and that's it. Where should I look for this cable now? This is also a very interesting question. But I will try to dig, I hope I will succeed. The console is sewn, of course, the games will be exactly the same. I don't want to bother and cut them myself, because why, when at a bargain price on local boards, a person will do it for you, who will completely recreate the same one for Dreamcasts. I think you know these guys who cut discs for 3-2, along with the box and all the seals. That is, it is completely the same visually, but the punk inside, which works, and the collector of dry does not pull yet, and it's too expensive for me. And of course the Japanese plug without a transformer, it was not included, the person clamped it, well, okay. I have a Saturn, I will use one and it turns out a purely Japanese family of consoles. True, Megatraf is a little extra here, he has an ordinary fork in his eye, well, okay. In general, the first feeling is great. I like the Dreamcast, even though its gamepad is a miracle in a non-positive way, well, okay. I'm not going to complain here yet, until I bought a view. When I do all this, then it will be possible to give a full answer. And you are waiting for a comparison with the PS1, because only after watching them you will be able to understand whether to buy this console or not. I already know the answer, but it is voiced in other videos. Subscribe, because there will be a huge number of videos for Rimka, just unreal. Until new videos and meetings.